Hey guys, welcome back. Today I have another manga haul for you. Today I have stuff from Right Stuff, eBay, and the comic book store. And it it might be a little deceiving how many boxes there are, but I don't think there's going to be a ton of manga. I can't remember how much I ordered, which saying that out loud hurts my bank account. But we will see once I open these. So I want to open these and then we'll see what I got. All right, it's all unpacked, and it is actually a little less. Uh, I, in my head, I I saw the three boxes, and I kind of freaked out because I have an order on the way, so I, I thought as soon as I saw three boxes that I received three, and I have another one on the way, which was a lot more than I thought I spent throughout this month and a half. But yeah, so this is what all I received. I'll go through it. Uh, as best as I can to remember. Um, first is a uh, Junji Ito sensor. Uh, it's something I saw at the comic store, and I really. That's embarrassing. Uh... Didn't happen. Okay, so, yep, just drop that. But yeah, Junji Ito sensor. Uh, I really enjoyed Uzumaki, and I haven't read Ramina yet. But just, uh, I read the back of this at the comic store and I thought it was super interesting. So once I get into a Junji Ito story, I'm gonna have to decide between Remina and this one. If you guys have read both, let me know which one you prefer and I'll read that one next. Uh, next is Terraformers Volume 1. I got this off of eBay. And the unfortunate thing is that it's a library book, but it's honestly in pretty good condition being a library book. The only thing that sucks is like, you know, they wrote on the inside of the front page and they got this weird tape thingy on there. But I mean, honestly, for a library book, it's in really good condition. Uh, I always, I heard from the Trash Taste podcast that the manga is like way better than the anime, which I tried watching the anime a long time ago and it was not great in my opinion. So maybe the manga is going to be good for me. And in this pile, I finally, I've been searching forever to get Platinum End Volume 1. And I finally got it. And I'm super stoked. I didn't know that the cover was going to be like holographic. So that's pretty sick. But uh, pretty much ever since that I knew that the authors that did Death Note did this. Uh, I've been super wanting to get into it. And I finally got it. I'm going to try to get like volumes two or three before I start reading it, but I'm also like contemplating if I should watch the anime since that's releasing right now. Uh, if you guys have started watching it, let me know if I should watch it or read because uh, I mean, odds are I'll just do both. Next I have volume four and seven of Chainsaw Man. Um, my quest to get volume two is still everlasting. It will never end. I've been trying for so long to get volume two because I really want to read more. Can't get it anywhere. Comic store, never in stock. Write stuff, never in stock. I I'm trying my best here. Uh, maybe I want to start looking at like Amazon or something. But I, I, I mainly try to get it from Write Stuff so it's a little cheaper, but Fucking A, it's impossible. Uh, next, this I got Scumbag Loser. Uh, the cover is a little like deceiving because it seems like it's gonna be this really gross anime. But apparently it's like a thriller where this guy fakes a long distance relationship, but then the person just arrives at a school and that person's supposed to be dead. So it was on sale on Right Stuff. So, and I, I read the summary, so it's very interesting to me. Hopefully, it is good. Um, but it's a pretty hefty book, and I'm pretty sure, like, this is just the whole thing, all in one, so pretty excited for that. 
Next, I got uh, Foley Coley, the Omnibus. This was at the comic store as well. Um, don't really know how you could pass up on it. Uh, the, I remember watching some episodes as a kid. Don't remember any of it, <laughs> but I remember enjoying it. Uh, my brother was with me and he just said buy it. So I'm like, okay, and here we are. Uh, next is another omnibus of Shaman King. This is the fourth one. Um, so yeah, I am still in the same conundrum as I've always been, as if I'm like, should I wait until more of the anime releases or should I just read the manga? Is the manga the same? I don't know. Uh, I will say one of my complaints in one of my previous videos was the spines didn't look good. I actually like the look of the spine. It, It's not like off-putting. It's, it's actually a nice spine. The other ones are, I don't know, they just don't mesh for me. Um, next I finally got Bleach Volume 3. I can finally start reading Bleach. Um, there's a list of things I wanted to read this year, a video, and this was one of them. Uh, I will put the link in the description to that video in the, the description, obviously. But yeah, I got volume three and six. So I can read, I think, one through six. I might have more on the way as well. Pretty much, like if you haven't seen my video of like completed series I'm trying to buy, I'll also link in the description. This is like one of those things on Write Stuff that once like there's a sale and I need like a few books to get free shipping. I usually type in bleach first and I see what's in stock. It's not like too far off of where I'm collecting because I don't want to just have like random spots in my collection because that's how it has been for bleach. I'm trying to just fill those spots in so it's like a continuous thing and I get to start going from like seven, eight, nine and so on. But it was been a pain in the butt to, to collect. Um, next is volume four of Zom 100. I am up to date so far and I will hopefully stay up to date with Zom 100. I'm really excited to get into reading this. Um, this isn't like on my top read list right now because I just have so many things to read but once I you know either open up some space or if I get volume five as well I will definitely read this. I got volume two. I also got volume one of solo leveling this month. Uh, volume one is currently on my shelf because I read it. Um, I will probably read this either tonight or tomorrow night on one sitting. Very excited to read this. The series is so good. The You can't go wrong with colored pages. Like, it, it, this is just a fantastic read so far. Next, I got volume 9, 10, and 11 of Attack on Titan. I'm just slowly making progress of completing the series. I'm still trying to, you know, complete it before the anime is over. But, I mean, it's going to be a hard challenge for me to do, but I think I can do it. And then I also got volume 9 and 10 of Ajin Demi Human. I am getting pretty close to completing this series. I am almost done reading volume 5 of Ajin, and then I'll read through, you know, 10. I, I, I just love this series so much. It's very enjoyable. The action's great. There's a lot of gore. The story's pretty great too. And being like the second series that I ever started reading has a really close place in my heart. And I hope it's good till the end. Please don't have a bad ending. That would suck. And then I got the Volume 4 of Berserk Deluxe Edition. This is definitely high on my, read, my reading list. I recently finished uh, Volume 3. So good. It is... <laughs> like, I feel like almost a normie to say that so far Berserk is my favorite manga. But, I mean, I, I just... It's, it is so good, you know? I, the, there's so much action... The story is constantly compelling. Uh, the characters are great. Art is fantastic. I, 
I mean, I might be a little favoritism because this is like the first thing I ever bought manga wise and it's what got me to where like my collection is right now. But I mean, I could also, you know, blame it for costing me for a couple grand and just manga. But anyways, I love Berserk. I recommend this to anyone who likes action anime with some like dark stories. Don't want to say too much, but yeah, it's great. And then I got Volume 2, Master Edition of Blame. I started to read Blame and I got like six chapters in. I don't know how I feel about it. Maybe I should keep on reading. For anyone who's read it all, tell me if I'm wrong. I don't know. There's just, I don't know what it is. Maybe I need to be baby fed the story. Maybe I need to be spoon fed every detail because I'm just kind of lost. Maybe it all comes together soon, hopefully. I might be dumb. I just, I the artwork, great. But sometimes I also get lost in the action. So, I don't know. I'll, I'll probably read through this volume before I like decide I like cut it out or not. But so far it's just, it's just kind of eh for me. But leave me comments if I'm wrong. Maybe I'm just overthinking it or maybe I'm just a baby brained reader. But yeah, this is my manga haul. It's kind of like a medium manga haul for me. Not too big, not too small, perfect size. You know how it is. Uh, let me know in the comments things I should buy, things that I should stop buying. I don't know. Have a discussion in the comments with me. I enjoy your comments a lot. It brightens my day. Uh, and leave a like, you know, subscribe if you want to. I do this once a week, kind of, when I can. Uh, but yeah, have a good rest of your day, week, month, whenever I see you again. And yeah, see ya. Perfect.